Hey guys, something wonderful has happened. I am supposed to be at work right now, but I just called with the customs office and they told me there's a package waiting for me. So hang on, we're gonna get it. It's gonna be fun. Okay guys, I just hijacked another conference room. So let's unpack that thing, uh, unbox it, so to say, and uh, get the goods out of it. So the packaging is well done. Thanks to Banggood, well done. Uh, seen worse, so I will just open it here. Where's my knife? My craft knife. It's here. Okay, there we go. Let me just get this off. Ooh, happy days. That's it. Away with the shit. There we go. Not here. Not here. Ah, oh, here. Packaging has some dents, it's pretty normal when you come from China, long way to go. But some of you might have seen in uh, Matthew Ogborn's video, it's pretty good packed. And this is a magic box, the almost most valuable box in the whole thing because it's uh, empty, it's a kit version, away with the shit. Then we have we have this little sucker and this is the canopy, the main section, the fuse large. Right. Maybe a little cut here. Don't cut your fingers. There you go. Pretty nice. Shiny, detachable. The front section is uh, detachable as well. Yeah. Mounts for cameras, pretty good. I find this to be fine. Good quality. I've seen worse. Okay, main section. Then, side of that, whatever this may be. Ah, it's winglets uh, with some bolts of plywood, plywood I would say. Um, supposed to be screwed on here, but I doubt it will last long, so I'll make a solution for that. Let's put it aside. <coughs> Alternative notes sections for different camera styles. If you got a GoPro session, the traditional GoPro style, or Xiaomi D, whatever you fly. And I think this one in the middle is uh, attached now, must be the one for the um, Foxy Legion 3 Runcam 2 style cameras. I start with that, it's good. Now we got some nice diggers. But I doubt I will use them. Yeah, I do. Uh, this little sheet, which is supposed to be, uh, you know, how do I do sheet? And this must be the last box with the wings. And so it is. They are fine. Let me look. Let me look and open. So, if you saw the video from Matthew, from Matt, cheerio, by the way, his wings had some dents. But if you look here, pretty nice. No dents here. Got some marks here, but that is pretty normal. Um, a detachable section here, which isn't detachable at all. I guess it's not supposed to be detachable, but well, I'll find out. Some carbon here, and yeah, it's a bit bendy in the section by the surfaces, but uh, I guess I will reinforce that later on. Second wing, oh, something for that. Um, hinges, uh, push rods. You see, okay. Second wing, which actually has a little dent. Ooh. 
Oh. <laughs> Seems they always have to have some dance. But this is minor. Just take some boiled water and get this back in shape. No problem at all. As I can say, it's pretty shiny. I really like it. I don't know where to put the receiver and VTX, but I'll find a way. Okay, other than that, nothing special to say. Nothing you haven't seen by now. Uh, carbon spar. Just. Uh, Simply attach it in here. It doesn't feel that right. I don't know. <clears throat> Let's see. If you just put it in here and get it out, if we get it out, something could be blocking. know how to to do this because it won't fit. Ah no stupid me. Okay. Second wing note to you out there it's not the bigger hole it's the smaller one. The bigger must be for the lids for the server. So attach it like that. Put the canopy on back, and there you have your wing. Overall, pretty nice. And with that, the episode ends. But don't worry, we'll be back pretty soon with new stuff, and keep you updated if we have something for you. So, the series of the R Wing will continue, and you can join us on Facebook. Click the links we have deposited in the description. Thanks. Bye-bye.